Ladies and gentlemen, early in March, I ran into a fine piece of talent down in Miami. A kid who might be the Danny Kay of tomorrow. May I bring out Joel Gray. Joel, come out here, Joel. <laughs> Joel Gray, I understand that your ambition is to, uh, your ambition is to be a comedian? That's right, sir. Uh, why? Why? Uh, have you any reason? Well, I guess it's because my dad's a comedian. Maybe you know him. Mickey Katz? Oh, Mickey Katz. Of course I know Mickey Katz from Miami. But uh, here's Mickey Katz and your Joel Cray. Why did your father change his name? Uh, he didn't change his name, sir. I changed mine when I went into show business. Joel Gray and Katz. You know what Benjamin Franklin said at night? All cats are gray? <laughs> did Benjamin Franklin say that? Yes, he did. And what did you say to him? <laughs> yes, Joel, you're a comedian, all right. And one day, you may be on the cover of Look Magazine, as are all of the comedians in television today in this current issue. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, I nominate for stardom, Joel Gray from Miami Beach. Here he is. Listen to me, everybody, what I say. I'm a boy that's happy because I look my age. Too young to be the governor or king for a day. I've got news for all you folks. Youth is here to stay. Who has more fun than a boy? I mean, fun that's the real McCoy. Like football and baseball and swimming a lot. You never see kids walking around with a pot. My pop says, son, now in my day, you should have seen me dance. Well, I can do the Charleston without bell-bottom pants. My mother rocked me in her arms to music of her day. She sang me tender lullabies like moonlight on the bay. Me, I take my music straight, no saxophony moans. Give me the songs of Frankie Lay and the class of Spike Jones. Don't do this, don't do that, it's all I hear at home. Eat your food, make your bed, it's whirling in my dome. And so I run to have some fun, cause youth is here to stay. Oh, I got a girl that's out of this world, and we dance the night away. My mother raised me very well, according to the book. She studied child psychology. Pop would clean and cook. My dad's a bit old-fashioned. I'll tell you why that's so. He still likes a star that sang like this. Eighty years ago. If you know Susie, like I know Susie. Oh, 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 my God. I'm so classy, this is her lassie. Oh, 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 my goodness, what a jazzy. That's his music. Oh, what a man. An institution older than the Morris plan. You know Tanner, like I know Tanner. Oh! I'm healthy, I'm happy. Haven't got a care. Haven't got an ulcer. Haven't got the hair. Young enough to lick the world, my spirit is aglow. Eighteen years of age and I'm ready to go. Ready to go. Ready to go. Are you Joel Gray? Well, yes, I'm Joel Gray. I have something for you. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Since
since you are so healthy, and since you're youthful too, greetings, kid, from Uncle Sam. Signed, Draft Board 102. <laughs> Joel Gray, I have something to tell you. You belong in a Broadway show. Honestly, you do. As a producer out front tonight, spoke to him before, saw his rehearsal today, and in the next two weeks, they're going to start rehearsals for a show called Curtain Going Up, and if you like, you're a member of that company. Okay, Joel? Thank you, sir. Ah, <laughs> uh, isn't he young? Isn't he wonderful? He's so wonderfully young, I could kill him. 